Okay, this is the second video sequence on the review for the 11 to 13 inch double injected fetal pig dissection. Uh, this video sequence will cover figures three and four, which are the male and female reproductive structures. So if you have these diagrams, you might take a look at figures three and four. Uh, the male is figure three and the female is figure four. We'll start with the male. And so we are in the kind of the lower abdominal cavity. And as you can see, the testicle has been extracted in this uh, pig. And the place that I start on both the male and the female in terms of a location to uh, start to find these structures is the base of the urinary bladder. And so the urinary bladder is right here. Remember, just under, underneath uh, the umbilical vein on the back side of the umbilical cord. And if you go down at the base of the urinary bladder, you'll find this thin white thread structure that runs transverse side to side across the base of the urinary bladder. And you can see over here, it comes over and joins up with the spermatic artery, and it kind of disappears down into the body wall here. Where this goes into the, the wall of the body wall of the pig, that's called the inguinal canal. And it's really a combination of the vas deferens and the spermatic artery that make up the spermatic cord. And you can see it a little bit better maybe over here on the, this side. So here's the vas deferens. And if I kind of pull that up a little bit, hopefully you can see the spermatic artery coming down to join it. It's just underneath right here. Those two structures together make up the spermatic cord. So you have the vas deferens, the spermatic artery, and the spermatic cord, which came out of the inguinal canal, which is right in through this area here. This is the testicle, and the testicle is made up of two parts. The testis, this darker region, is where the sperm is made, and then the epididymis, this lighter colored region, is where the sperm is stored. So those are all the major uh, internal structures. If we go up to the outside, just below the umbilical cord, you can see the opening to the penis. And so this is the penal opening right here. And embedded or running through the lining of the penis is the urethra, a common duct for both uh, urine and uh, sperm to leave the body. And then if we come down to the bottom, just uh, posterior on the outside, you see these two little pocket-like structures, which is the scrotum. And those are the male reproductive structures in the pig. Um, one of the things that is common on both the male and the female in terms of structures that you will find on um, figures three and four are the kidneys and the ureter. And so just above up here, uh, there are two kidneys that kind of lay near the base of the back. And then if you break that connective tissue and look around a little bit, you'll find this tube that comes off the, uh, the bottom of the kidney, and that is the ureter. And that is the same in both figures three and four. So let's take a look at the female real quick. Okay, um, <clears throat> excuse me. On the female, start in the same location, start at the base of the urinary bladder. And on this one, um, you have two twisted coiled tubes that kind of come off the base of the urinary bladder. Those are the uterine horns. But if you come to the, where those connect, kind of right down here, pretty deep at the base of the urinary bladder, this is the body of the uterus. So start here, you have the body of the uterus, and then the tubes coming off the bottom of the body of the uterus are the uterine horns. At the end, or the tips of the uterine horns, is the ovary, and so the ovary is right here. And if I move that ovary a little bit, you can see the ovarian artery coming down here. And so you have the body of the uterus, the uterine horn, the ovary, and then the ovarian artery. If we go to the outside of the pig, there are three openings, okay? And those, those three tubes come through basically the opening in the pelvis. The first tube, is the urethra, and then that middle opening just below it is the opening to the vaginal canal, 
And then the bottom opening, just underneath that, just underneath the tail, is the uh, rectum. And so those are the reproductive structures, basically figures three and four um, for the fetal pig dissection.